I want you to try and think about what these items have in common. Any idea? I expect you're probably confused. You see, all these items hold a memory for me. Getting my bathroom refurbished. Going on holiday to Thailand. My friend stealing chocolate at an art exhibition. Buying a 50p bag of pick and mix and paying in 1p coins. Being at the barrier in a very rowdy crowd at my first festival. Coming home from New York. Almost dying. Sitting in bed when I was 11, reading the same seven lines out loud because I thought they sounded cool. My 15th birthday. The bus ride to school before my first art exam. Being stung by coral while snorkelling and having an injection. Going into London the night before my GCSE maths exam. Having a fat lady push my back down while doing middle splits. A long school coach ride for Spain. Going for brunch with my friend from Switzerland. At the start of this video, these were all just random, unrelated objects which you probably couldn't find any clear link between. But for me, they all trigger memories. Memories transport us back to a place or time. We have good ones and we have bad ones some that we hope we'll remember forever and others that we give anything to forget. But isn't it strange that just a smell of perfume, a song, an object can trigger these memories? That we can be transported back through time by such a simple thing? It's incredible to think that when I'm old and grey and have more years behind me than I can ever imagine living through, the smell of a perfume might take me back to being a teenager. Your memories are one of the only things you take through life with you. And for someone as hopelessly sentimental as me, that's a pretty amazing thought.